it's all come down to the wire. Can I add an Indian National League title to my Irish First Division Manager of the Year award? Yeah, the Rudy Gutendorf challenge has just got serious. We're top of the league. We've got two games to go. If we win both, we will be champions. Let's just, I can't wait. Just let's get straight into the episode. Hi guys, Chris here from Heed the Ball Gaming and welcome back to another episode of that Football Manager 20 save for Rudy Gutendorf Challenge where we're trying to manage 55 teams in the one year. Just We're trying to do it whether we can or not, just as many as we can, try and reach the record holder. Rudy Gutendorf, he's the man who's managed most clubs in the history of football and we want to get near him, we want to see how many we can get in a single year of Football Manager. And we've got Mohamedan today, we are ninth in the table, we've avoided relegation and we're just going to go for it straight away. I'm really quite, I'm not quite nervous actually, this team can be hit or miss. We're for singing goals, we've got she, Aldor, Dot, the Art of Talisman, Waralita, Diara, Lewis, Wagabam, <laughs> Wagenbam. I love that name, eh, Putia, Bogdanovic and Marcel Sacramento. So good to named them after a city. I've dropped Teddy just to see if the dynamics between Sacramento and Bogdanovic slightly better. Then it was one of them I had to, and Bogdanovic probably plays slightly better. It's over to you, have a good one. That's not going to work, is it? <laughs> um, I do not want to discuss my feelings. I want to win first and foremost. It's a funny old game because Jimmy Hill said that, didn't he? Was it Jimmy Hill or was it Jimmy Greaves? Jimmy Greaves, I think he's... It was Jimmy Greaves, wasn't it? It was one of the Jimmys. And he knew what we were talking about. Yeah, then Jimmy Hill was... As much as I'm a Scotsman and all the laugh and everything we had. Oh, what a safe I sing. He was a bit of a footballing genius, to be honest, Jimmy Hill. Just need to look at his work as a manager. What he did for Coventry City. Fulham. One of the underappreciated greats of world football. These guys are going for it, aren't they? Oh, and a save, and oh, Foster a day. He's a guy we let go to. <laughs> he just signed for them. Oh. He's come back to haunt us. Malupia. Well, wait a minute, if we lose this. Still in our hands, isn't it? Because we're a point clear. A day's up for this. He wants to prove it. <laughs> Penalty. <sighs> Penalty. A day's loving this. <laughs> A day is loving this. He's saying, <laughs> if you'd kept me, you'd have won the title. We're all over the place. It's like we've shouts, show some passion. Come on, let's do it. Let's get back into this. No, what don't want to do it. Don't want to win a title. Islam. Oof. That should have been. It's the worst performance of the season so far. Show some passion. We've got she, Lewis, Diara, crosses to Punte, goes past him. Oh, tackled. Lewis, oh, that's, and it's, you know when it's not going to be your day when these sort of things don't go in. We've got she, Aldor. They're fired up too late. 
<laughs> two and all. I wasn't expecting this. East Bengal are losing as well. So what's the league table looking like? Updates. We're still top. Um, team talk, aggressive. You're letting yourself down. Start the second half. Show some passion. Right. Sacramento's coming off. Tate's coming on. No. Very attacking. A man more. Should have won this. This was easy. Updates. Oh, we've just scored again. <laughs> and it's Foster a day. He's just loving this. We're top of the league. Still. Just holding on. I should have paused that there. He didn't do that for me when I was manager. There's no point. Game's gone. We've got to what? <laughs> Updates. This is going to be affecting our goal difference. At least East Bengal are getting absolutely annihilated as well. So let's say. Uh, Let's take that into consideration. We're Pia with the goal. Show some passion. Dressing room, team talk, aggressive. It's not good enough. I don't know what to say about that. That was. We're still top of the league, but <laughs> yeah, we could have won that today. If we had won that game, East Bengal lost as well. So they'll be kicking themselves. Manvera Punjab have came right back into it. We've got a four, four goal deficit to make up as well. So they'll be really going for it. It's been a seven goal swing in their favour. Right, I'll see you for the next game. So we're back for the make a break game and it's a bit clearer what we need to do now of course we've got three players suspended who are our two best defenders um, um, right so we're back it's a bit more clearer what we have to do obviously we've got three players suspended who are our three best right so we're back it's a bit clearer what we need to do Everyone else seems to have played apart from us in East Bengal. We've um, got our three top players out, obviously. We've got... <sighs> right, we're back for the important East Bengal. Um... Right, we're back for the... Um... Right, for... <laughs> We're back for the East Bengal game. This is the most important game in the club's history. Of course, we've got three players suspended who are vitally important to the squad. Um, trying to think who's odd. Sanjay Dote is suspended. We've also got um, Rugoche, who's leaving the club at the end of the season. He's probably our best defender. He's out. And obviously, Robinson Singh, he's injured. Our best Indian midfielder and Keen Lewis is suspended so we're going to ring the changes but it's a bit clearer what we need to do if we just look at the um, competitions so we're top of the league 
Manera Punjab didn't win their game in hand. They lost. Well, they've already played their game. We draw or win, we'll be champions. If East Bengal win, they'll be champions. If they draw, we're champions. So let's do it. And the team we're going for Singh, Mendes, Dote, Raman and Warahita. Not the defence I wanted to go with. But we've got Diara sitting in front of him. So hopefully he'll offer some protection. I did think about dropping him back. Make I might just do that. That's a bit of a risk, isn't it? To have any other defensive midfielders. Wagaman. Can he play there? Sacramento. Let's, let's put Sacramento there and hope for the hope for the best. <laughs> Mateta, Wagabam, um, Punte, Bogdanovic and Tete. And let's just go for it. Let's, let's what can go wrong? <laughs> well, worst we can finish a second, so this has been a good season all round, considering when I took over we were second bottom. Which would have been relegation uh, slots because Indian Arrows can't get relegated. I think it's because they're, it's their first um, season in the league. Uh, nothing less than a win. Nothing like putting pressure onto them. Wait and see, it's down to my players. I'll play a bit here. Good team. And it's given a consideration. Come on, let's do it. I'm quite nervous about this, especially with this centre back pairing. Hopefully, Dot and Diara, because Dot is a solid centre back, so if Diara beside him, hopefully, the Sacramento maybe he's just sitting in there and doing some clever work because he's a good passer of the ball, so. Bogdanovic, the Irishman. Uh, oh, he looks like he's running through treacle and he takes a shot. Got to show the club what, what I brought him in for. He had that one really good game where he scored four goals. But he's not lived up to the potential that I saw in him. Way back at Cove Ramblers. Sacramento. And Dot! Oh, and I thought the, the big centre half was going to come up with a goal. It's about 50 50, it's an equal game, so we can't say we're dominating things. We've got to go aggressive. We're not happy with performance. We should be winning this. It's a risk. Basically, when we're, oh, we need a draw, don't we? So, Diara punched away. Sacramento's going to get there. The Brazilian. Mendes. Tepunte. Oh, bounced off and Singh's going to run. It's a counter attack for them. But Lorita deals with it beautifully. Lorita Hara, is that how you say it? And then Meta. Away, Perita, give it to one. Sacramento, the Brazilian that's leaving. That could be the best leaving present ever. So good they named a city in Florida after him. If it isn't, it is, it is now. He's playing in that unfamiliar defensive midfield role. Yeah, and unfortunately he's leaving. Both of them came back and they decided they were leaving, but they you know, didn't get their huge wages off the wage bill though for Sacramento, Wagenham. And Meta, oh, that sneaks in. The title's ours, surely. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I'm getting so excited. First title of Football Manager 20. Meta, I know, oh, Dagar, what a, that's worse than any goalkeeping I've seen in football, my hands are 20. Probably realistic though. Shouts, let's praise them, they're doing well. And they can keep playing because it's much like the last game where I just lost interest. 
There's nothing else on the bench, so... Did the car... We haven't had any highlights, so this is a goal, isn't it? Oh! Who's bum rescued us? Rorahita Hara. He's, a, he's been the player of the match for me. Meta. Mendes. Oh, dis dispossessed. Diara. This has been a tactical masterclass for me to play him as a centre back. And Sacramento is the defensive midfield. It's something I never thought about doing until this game. When um, injuries called upon it. Teta. Oh, beautiful. And there he is. That is a that is a fantastic strike to wrap things up. <laughs> and the uh, annoyance I felt in the last game is, is ebbing away now. And hopefully they'll support me now. I'll make some subs just to get the young lad on from Bogdano. And Mete on for Punte. Let's go for it. Sacramento, the centre forward taking the corner for some reason. He's doing a Harry Kane. Don't like your, I don't like my main forwards doing the old uh, corner kick taking. They should be the ones in the box because they've got the quickest reactions, haven't they? So there's Rabi. Not had enough game time to be honest. That's probably why he's got finishing a four, which is oh, what a hitahara! He's gonna get sent off. <sighs> that was clumsy, mate. And Teddy was gonna come off because I'm not gonna take Rabi off. He's just come on. And Chatinta, easy for me to say, comes on for Teddy. And there he is there. And Rabi is going up front himself for the last four minutes of the game. And away and Mete gets the ball. There's not much up. He's got to do it himself. He looked at Rabi and thought, I've got a better chance of scoring myself, so I'll just run halfway up the pitch. What a tighten up and preserve a lead, I think it's done. I don't think we need to worry about that. And look at that, we've got the ticker tape, got me clapping, and yeah, look at that, beautiful. First title wrapped up of the Rudy Gutendorf challenge. <laughs> and that is fantastic, team talk. Congratulations, these are the moments every footballer dreams of. That is it. Surely they're going to support me now. Win it in the final day. In the National League. Let's see, what does it say about me? The ball famously knocked at University College Dublin in the Senior Challenge Cup Well, Cove Ramblers. And I've lifted a trophy with fantastic. Fair and disappointed. Yeah, that's fair enough, mate. I'll do this in a minute. Ban for two matches, except he's fine. It's a stupid sending off, but it was didn't affect us. And we've done that. Now there we go, look at that. <laughs> and the border. Thank me for my unexpected success. I brought it on myself because I did say it. And these players all get title medals. And we get £545. Don't spend that all at once. Right, we'll move on a little bit sooner just to see if we can find out what's going on. We're on form. Sacramento plays very well. That was his last ever game for us. And Simic. India boss. Agar Simic. Hmm, that's an unusual one. I didn't realise he was manager India. And let's see, £109,000. That's going to take a good way to wipe out our debt if we can get rid of some of the big 
name players, then that would help as well. Fantastic. Right, I'll play on to see if we get the Player of the Year awards and stuff. Right, here we are with the Player of the Year awards. As you can see, a couple of players got their contracts renewed. Wagabam, who's just getting it just for his name, to be honest. Robson Singh, who has been absolutely sensational this season. Such a big improvement. He, one star, he's played really well. I'm over the moon he's got a new contract. And Sanjay Dot has an absolute rock at the back. I don't know why, because he's got Taco in a six, Mark in a five, and Head in a six. So <laughs> he's not exactly the, the greatest player to ever live, but you know, he's good for Indian terms. We've got two players named in the team of the year Sanjay Dot, Orahara, and Pandira and Lewis. None of our centre forwards got a, a look in. Kromba plays as the player of the year, Azamar Kromba, Liberian. Yeah, I have better players. Dicker, the top goal scorer, you know. Bogdanovic, even though he wasn't there the whole season, came third. Only 13 goals won it for Dicker. So, if Bogdanov had actually played well for the last tail end of the season, he probably would have got there with the, with the goals. The ball manager of the year, was there any other, other manager, to be honest? I managed to win the title after taking over sort of six games into the season and turning the season round. And we're pleased with winning the manager of the year. Fantastic. And the football league, are there any of my players? What a man does he mine? No, but he is. Oh, he's tasty. 22,000. Oh, I could... Make a wee bid for him if I've got any money next season. Um, Putia, that's he's mine. He's a player of the year. And the rest of them aren't mine, so not interested. But Putty, well done. And I think that's it. And Yuki's injured, but that's fine. He's on his way out of the club anyway. So in terms of my profile, we've got back to where I was, to be honest. We're up to 15%. So we went down to 10% when we took the job. Winning the title's taken us up at 5% and we're on that smidgen of a star. And I think if we finish this National 8 licence, we'll be up to 20%, which will be a head start from where we were in the, the Cove Ramblers. Um, job so hopefully hopefully that'll make us better I'm going to go rebuild this squad quite a bit um, and try and bring in some young guys and just make it a little bit more balanced and I will see you for next season I haven't been offered a new contract here yet um, 30th of the 6th 1921 is when it goes out so that's just under I imagine I will be offered a contract because you know I've just won the title it'd be stupid not to I'm planning for next season already, so we've signed one player. I can just take you to the transfers. He's on loan with us just now. This Juan Pablo Chineris. He's gonna be joining in January. Or December, isn't it? It's a weird it's a weird uh, transfer window. And he's a very solid goalkeeper. And we've also got the legend that is um Kane uh, Kean Leonard from Cove Rambors. He's not looking as good as what he did. He's starting to look a bit... Mm, I'm not so sure. <laughs> He's not scored in three games. It may have been a silly, foolish ch uh, transfer. And then Madar Benjali, who looks an absolutely brilliant one. And I'll have to move some of the foreign players out to facilitate these players coming in. I might just put uh, Kean Leonard straight back out on loan. That might be the plan, to be honest. Okay, on that note, I will see you for season three of the, season four, season four of the Beauty Gutendorf Challenge. See you soon.